says set at 100.
I'll put it to 800. That's about what it was on the GoPro when I just filmed that, so that should match. Uh, the dark should be darker and everything should be a little bit sharper. All right, I just switched it over to auto color. Cinematic D. Uh, the GoPro was on flat also, so it's it's pretty comparable. I would I would enhance both of them once I, I got to the computer with Final Cut. But here it is out of the out of the shoe. 800 ISO, 4K 30, normal mode. I have a feeling I'm gonna like it better, but I like it better because it's just oh, it's better colors. But I would fix that in post. All right, we'll do a little nighttime in the car filming in case you vlog at night. I have the, where's a couple of street lights around here. They have the interior lights on in the front part of the car. They're LED, so they're pretty bright. Um, so this is what it looks like with the DJI pocket. And I'm just holding about a foot, three inches or so away from my face. All right, we'll try the... Well, the whole plan was with the GoPro, but the battery died. That's my fault. Let's try with the iPhone now. All right, so we're filming now with the iPhone XS Max with the front camera on the iPhone. Same lighting. Um, maybe this is about the same distance away. I, can, I can't tell with the little camera on the Osmo, but this looks, the iPhone looks a little more grainier. The backside part of the camera, iPhone XS Max, the rear facing camera on the iPhone. Last it was a big old haze above, so I'm not sure what it looks like now. Okay, exciting stuff. All right, this is about where I was the night. I do have a street light and a lights inside the car. So we'll see how this looks with the grain on my face and what have you. Different hat, but same deal. All right, I hope you enjoyed it. Please subscribe, like, thumbs up, and all that stuff. Or not. <laughs>